Hi guys, welcome to Talking with Camilo. Today we are going to talk about a book. His name is The Picture of Dorian Gray, which is a novel by Oscar Wilde uh, that was uh, first published in, in 1890. So first I'm going to introduce the main characters and then I'm going to talk about my perspective of this review, what I think about um, the, um, the themes of this, of this book. With that we are going to make a, a little uh, review here. Okay, so first we have uh, Dorian Gray, which is the protagonist of this um, novel. He is a riantly handsome, impressionable, and wealthy young gentleman whose portrait the, the, the artist uh, Basil Howard paints. Under the, the influence of, the Lord, of Lord Henry Wadham, uh, Dorian becomes like extremely concerned uh, with the transience of his beauty and begins to pursue his own pleasure about all else. He devotes himself to having as many experiences as possible, whether mortal or immortal, elegant or, or sordid. Then um, we have the um, Lord Henry Wadden, so he's a novel, a nobleman and, and a close friend of Basil uh, Howard. He is urban and, and greedy. Then um, Lord Henry is, is perpetually armed and ready with the well-praised epigrams criticizing the moralism and hypocrisy of Victorian society. In his pleasure-seeking philosophy of new um, hedonism, which exposes got, um, garnering experiences that stimulate the senses without regard for conventional morality. And then this specific character, I think, that uh, plays a plays a vital role in Dorian's, Dorian's grace um, development. Then um, we have um, the, um, Bill Howard, so he's an artist and he's a friend of Lord Henry. Then uh, there's a part of the book that, um, that Basil, Basil met uh, Dorian and then from that time uh, Basil becomes obsessed with Dorian after meeting him at the party. He claims uh, that Dorian possesses a beauty so rare that it, it has helped him to realize a new kind of heart. So through Dorian, he finds the lines of a fresh school, and then um, Dorian also helps, um, also helps, um, sorry, um, Basil realize his artistic potential, and and then Basil made the um, the portrait of Dorian, um, and then he proved the um, the masterpiece of this of this painting. Then finally, we have um, Sibyl uh, Bain. So he, she is a poor, beautiful, talented actress with whom Dorian falls in love. Um, then Sybil's love for Dorian compromises her ability to act. Um, also, as her experience of true love in life makes her uh, realize the falseness of affecting emotion on stage. Okay, so the main thing or the main aspect that I noticed from this novel is about the perception of beauty. We all know that beauty is something that the humans um, are interested and because oh um, I want to I want to impress that girl I want to uh, look good I want to um, yeah I want to I don't know uh, take care about my myself and then but then there is sometimes that we put the, the the beauty above everything so that means that if you prefer to look good rather to be like uh, happy or or yeah, to, so in this in this book, so we see that that the beauty is considered like um, yeah, this is the main the main um, the main aspect. So then, if you look good, so you might be a, a good person. Also, we have a criticism by, um, from to to art. So that is that the art serves no other purpose than offer beauty. So through the picture of Dorian Gray, um, beauty, it is a means to revitalize the, um, the worried senses as indicated by the affect um, that Basil's painting has on the cynical Lord Henry. So also the art is to, to escape, to escape of the brutalities of the world. Dorian distances himself, um, not to mention his consciousness, from the horrors of his action by devoting himself of the study of beautiful things, music, jewels, uh, rare tapestries. So then, um, in a society, in a society where the prices or that prices beauty so highly, 
youth and physical attractiveness becomes um, viable commodities. Okay, so then I really like the book. I like the way how the um, Oscar uh, criticizes the um, the beauty and the art, in, and then also I I can reflective of 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 our society nowadays where we see that the beauty is 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 more important than other things that we have in the life or, or on, our, on our daily routine. We we want to be nice for other people. We nice. We try to impress other people to look nice, um, but then, and also is something is something where we try to escape from the from the from the problems in, in your family or problems in your personal life on your on your job. So yeah, so we 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 try to to make a, like a fake appearance to to society. And to hide um, the problems with, which in this society seems oh, um, you are dealing with with problems with your house, so we don't care about it. So then the humans um, try to hide that. So that's my my review. I hope that you guys enjoy it. So uh, I hope that in the future we we see you again.